Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey. And we're out here in the open seas training Quetz. Not by having her fight tentacles, though. I should really just get my repel ready. There's just no reason for me to fight this stupid fish. I mean, fish monster. I guess is the right pronunciation of what the hell tentacle is. I have to remember to buy max repels later on, too. Hello, sir. Fight me. Have you ever gone to the swimming at the sea at night? You can't say I have. Harold wants to fight. He brings out his Remerton steel. The world's most strongest handgun fish in the history of the world. So yeah, the current plan is to... I don't know, you know, I think I could probably- and the, No, I'm gonna train up Nux next. Is that Nux needs to be trained. Um, not only Nux, but also Kid Fisto needs to be trained, specifically because Gary is a- is an issue. Um, Dick Gary, aka Dokon. Um, he's the strongest gym leader by a wide margin. Um, Stronger than all the rest of them combined, and he doesn't really have a type from what I remember. He just kind of exists. Hello, ma'am? Pant, pant. Just a little farther to Fuchsia City. Sheldar! So yeah, that's the current plan. Um, after I get out of the water, I'll put Kid Fisto back in the team. And I think next will probably be Nux in terms of training. Just because, like, he needs it. I think he's the lowest uh, EXP currently of anyone in the team. Oh, damn it. No, no, I'm gonna have to actually legitimately switch out. I don't want to risk this Cloyster for some reason knowing Blizzard or Ice Beam. He knew Aurora Beam, which is not as scary as either of the moves I just mentioned, but... Better safe than sorry. Better safe than dead is my motto. Yeah, I forget, cause especially because in the current way we are now, um, it's very, it's, you forget that it's a Nuzlocke. I've been doing slammingly well, uh, especially after the Elite Four. Haven't really had much issue that I can speak of. goes down. Let's get some EXP, and now we fight the next one. I'm drowning! <laughs> Can't help you, bud. I'm disgusted by wimpy people. Damn, girl. He's drowning. Hello. I say that to every single one of these. It's, <laughs> it's funny to me. I don't know if it's funny to you, but... A hundred episodes in, I don't think anyone- if anyone didn't find it funny, they either left a dislike, or they just stopped watching. Which, they probably stopped watching around episode 10. Which makes sense! Those locks are long, man. They're super long. Especially now that they come out in 10 minute chunks, basically. Quetz grew to level 49. She's so strong. I could beat you at swimming. I'd like to see you try, fancy pants. Alright, this guy. Swimming? I'm lousy at it. I'm just splashing around in these shallow waters. Hey, we all can't be fantastic. Some of us, like Jerome, are bad. Oh crap, he's level 26, are you kidding me? I'm not gonna get any XP from this. These could have been a bit leveled better <laughs> to me, honestly. Some of these are just super easy. Not that I don't mind easy wins, but without EXP share, this would take forever. This fucking guy. This thing is weaker than the tentacle I find in the ocean. It's not worth my time. 
What? It's a it lived? Wouldn't it have been funny if it killed me right then and there? While I was wiping, uh, my hands. I was technically touching my face, which you're not supposed to do, but... I washed my hands just a bit ago, so I should be fine. I mean, who knows, to be honest. Man, you want to talk about something scary, I'm not prepared to go back into the real world, especially with someone who, um... Gets sick very easily because I was born premature, so I have low immunities. It's not a very. It seems like almost like they're just willing to send people to die. And to be honest, the last thing I would like to do is die. So, if work tells me I have to work out, I'll try and figure out what to do, but I might switch to an all online focused work schedule or something. I don't know. Unless they're paying me a huge amount of dollars, I just don't feel comfortable actually going into work. Not until this thing is all clear and safed up. But also, apparently, based on early plans, it looks like we're all just going to be back in the house September, because people are stupid, and we opened early. People are stupid and companies are, you know, companies. Speaking of dumbass companies, WWE, everyone's favorite talking subject, I think, the most talked about subject in all of the Nuzlocke history of episodes, um, they finally had a wrestler test positive for, uh, the virus. So a friend of mine, I think it was Captain Ginyu, told me that, um, YouTube takes out any video that specifically talks about it in actual terms, so you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about when I'm talking about the virus. Um, the current epidemic sweeping the nation specifically in America, because everywhere else is starting to get down a little bit. Oh, God. Just in general, man, things are bad. You know, not the greatest. Not to bring anyone down, anyone that's watching this, by the way, because I have a feeling a lot of people are just trying to look for an escape out of here, and I understand and I'm perfectly fine with being that for you, but I don't know, man. Sometimes shit's just rough. There ain't really nothing you can do about it. And now, I go into the Pokemon Center. Do 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 do. Now I can get rid of. Get rid of, but more like return to his glory. Let's deposit Butterfing. Butterfing, you've lasted in the team very good. I might bring you back out when I fight Gary. Let's see, there's Kid Festo. Yeah, both Kid Fisto and, um... Um, Kid Fisto and... Nux have reached to the bottom of the team. You hate to see it, honestly. Let's see, 48, 45... Actually, Jolene's not that far off either, now that I look at it. I need so much training. Let's switch. Item, give, where's the dragon fang? Nope, that's a great ball. Alright. Give. That's a great ball. Dragon fang, yes. Then go up to Nux. Give EXP share. Yep. Perfect. Okay. I wonder. No, I was about to say, I wonder what Pokemon Blue has. But I think he might have like an Umbreon, maybe? I can't remember. It's been so long. I know he has his basic Pokemon from, I think, the Pokemon League. Which I think is kind of bullshit, is that he took over the Giovanni gym, which is an Earth gym, and he said fuck you to the theming and just runs his regular ass team, at least from what I remember. That's like the cruelest thing someone could do to unexpected tra trainers. Like, how do you expect to cultivate anything if your eighth gym leader's a dick? I mean, to be fair, so is mine. She freaking refused to give me my damn, um, badge until I did some useless fetch quest for her. 
Zato. Zatu's eyes on his stomach are so freaky, man. I don't trust Zatu when I look at Zatu. Also, I cannot believe how much Nux's moves have not changed since basically the beginning of the damn game. He still has Quick Attack. He still has Tackle. He still has Smoke Screen. Those are all literally the moves he learned at the beginning of the game. And he has had them this entire time. I forget that that's how old Pokemon games were really like, though. Flamel. I don't think I need Nightmare for this. We'll see after he hits me with a Psychic Blast, but I don't think we need Nightmare. Yeah, he only knows Psybeam. Psybeam hurts, but it's not Psychic. If he confused me, that would have been bad. Very, very bad. Critical hit. That's what I'm talking about, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Level 45. Not bad, not bad. Why? Why are you trying to learn Swift right now? No! Yes. Fucking grown-ass Pokemon at level 45 trying to learn Swift. I forgot to do my homework. Shut up, Tommy. No one cares about you. And with that, that's the end of today's episode, everyone. Join me for the next one. Goodbye.